All right, so we'll go to our web browser and we'll type in plex.tv and we'll click sign up. And you can uh, use a Google or a Facebook account or you can use uh, an email address. I just skipped past that part. All right, now we'll head back to plex.tv and click launch and we'll head over to the left hand tool toolbar and click your media. You'll have an option to get Plex Media Server. So we'll go ahead and download the Plex Media Server. And when it's done downloading, we will install it. And I'm going to skip past the install process here. It's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, and when it's done installing, you're going to go back to Plex.tv and you'll click Launch. Uh, which is up in the right hand corner and you'll sign in with whatever account you use to create your Plex account and you might see a different screen before you get to this one but eventually you'll get to this one and you'll click more over in the left hand toolbar click uh, it'll say your name and you're going to click the plus sign next to your name and this is going to let you add media so we're going to add music click music and then you can name it whatever you want. I'll name mine PC Music Collection. I'll click Next. And we're going to browse the computer for your media. And if you have it on an external hard drive, you can find the drive on the left hand side. Otherwise, you can uh, find wherever you have your music saved. I have mine on my desktop in a folder called Megasync Downloads. I just added a couple folders for the purpose of this tutorial. Um, so you can just click and select whatever folder you want. And if you want to click individual folders, you do have to add them uh, one at a time, I believe. So you would, you know, click that and add it. But I want the whole thing, so I have it selected. Click Add. It'll add uh, all my files. There's two, two songs under one album, so I clicked Add. And now the library is being updated and there's the album right there so you can play music uh, right from your PC or your desktop but since we want to play it on the phone we're going to head on over to the phone so go to Play Store and search for Plex and then you'll install Plex open it up and you'll sign in again with whatever email you use to create your account. Uh, so go up to the left hand menu and you'll click sign in up at the top there. Sign in with your account. All right and now there's only one step left after this. This is where we have to pay to activate the uh, service otherwise it only lets you play 60 seconds of a song so I'm gonna go ahead and pay the one-time five dollar fee so we'll click activate and it's gonna take you to a page where you can uh, either subscribe to Plex Pass or just click activate to do the one-time only purchase which is what I chose to do and now you should be good to go. can play all your music whenever you want as long as you're connected to the same Wi-Fi network as your home computer. Thanks for watching.